Welcome back to Overland 21. Today we're going to be installing uh, Sun Idea um, Sunshade. We're going to be doing the front only for now, and then another day we're going to be doing the back. The back one is going to be used more for storage at the time because we really don't take off our back, but we like to take off our front. And um, I like it so far. The quality seems really good. It has a 10 year warranty. A three-year warranty on these we bought it from Amazon where it was on sale I was actually surprised how well the directions are because you know sometimes you buy things for Jeeps and the quality ain't that great they don't last like these handles we bought off of Amazon and they were two years old and they faded and breaking and not the best quality I mean I made some steps for my Jeep myself for the wife to get in and out easy and they've been on there for a year now and then the wind continuously in the sun and they last a lot longer and in a lot better condition than the handles so i'll probably just make my own handles using some paracode but yeah installing these i mean it comes with everything even these little it comes with a little piece of paper for you to run the bungees because it says to do four corners and it's funny because I was like, what is, why did they include trash in here? But it's actually meant for uh, installing part of your sunshade. So don't put you down. Hopefully do a time lapse. But these bungees, uh, they're strong. So you're going to need to uh, actually work a little bit hard in some spots getting them. This one is easier. I tried doing the back and then I read the instructions better and I'm supposed to do the four corners first before doing anything else so that's where I'm at right now is trying to do the corners I'm gonna get you to the other side so you guys can watch but I'm hoping uh, I can leave this up throughout the year give it a nice little accent inside did the red the black was sold out but don't mind the red it matches the Jeep so you slide the paper in there's a little slit over here because of how these new roll bars are let's get up a little bit and once the paper slides down we should be able to feel it down by the windshield. Of course, when I'm on camera, it's a little bit harder, but there it is. So I'll show you. Paper comes out down here. If I could get a good grip. And just pull it down just like that and then once it's down you get the sun visor out the way you bring it up and strap it on like so let me get the paper out of there strap it just like that and the bungee holds so this is supposed to be able they have pictures where it actually holds people on it i'm not sure i believe that claim i know i'm not gonna weigh on it i'm over 250 pounds and uh if my wife wants to lay on it or if my daughter wants to lay on it and sunbathe by all means but i know i'm not getting up on top of it i don't think uh though i think that would void the warranty so let me go ahead and uh install the rest of these bungees and i'll get back onto the video when they're all done and show you what it looks like sorry so as i'm installing it i see uh the back is actually i'm not taking the top off so let me get this situated up here so you guys can see you can use this actually paper to get the corners here fish through because i'm not taking the top off and it makes it a lot easier to get the other side. Um, if you want, 
up, you can fold it the long ways. That way it's actually a longer piece of paper. Feed the fish to the other side. Make the reach it easier, but I think I like this idea. Up. Oh. And grab it the right way. There again. But you just get inside the paper like so, fold it, fish it through the top. You get the idea. Actually works pretty well. And then once it comes up through the sides, pull down, the bungee up and top. And I don't know if you were able to see all that, but it's real easy. It's uh, it's coming along nice. It's actually, I like it. It's nice and tight. Looks good. It's not a bad install. I mean, once you get everything figured out, I think the most stressful part so far I had was figuring out which bungee to put in the hole, which everything comes nicely labeled like I showed you guys. And once that's done, it's it's really plug and play. That's the way I would recommend it. Just have everything put up. They stay in the place as long as you don't pull the knobs. And just like that, another one is done. So, so far I'm enjoying it. Don't mind the install, it's actually easy. One person job. Let me get to the front and get back with you guys. So this is my last front one that I have right here. Um, I did on the other side and what I did was I pulled the bungee up and over the visor that way the little visor arm inside actually holds it too it doesn't say to do it in the instructions but something that I'm doing you don't have to but that's it that was the install it literally took me about 10 minutes to do I did realize uh I don't clean my Jeep as good as I thought I would up here on top it's very dirty so you might find out how dirty your Jeep is when you take your tops off and you actually look up there and you have to work in there but it looks really good I mean it's on there tight as you can see I mean that's the Sun up there yeah shade idea um, you can buy it on their website or you could go on Amazon like I did. I'll be adding the link in the description. If you buy it through me or you buy it using my link, I get a little portion over there as I'm affiliated now with Amazon. But yeah, uh, I recommend it. By the looks of it, it's good. And then with a 10 year warranty, let's see how well this holds up. Um, I have one for my JKU. Not by this company, but it was a little different. It was a whole one piece, and I do like the concept. My wife likes the idea. Gonna go for a drive and see how well it works. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope uh, this product works for you and works for me as good as I think it will. Uh, subscribe, like the video if you do. Uh, hope your off-road adventures are going well. Hope life is treating you good and you guys are being safe out there. Till next time, talk to you guys later. Bye.